Grand Rising, beautiful people. Welcome to my channel in the Notero 1122. All right, so Leo, let's see what messages we have. All right, Leo, you showing up, showing up. All right, so you have the world, you have the king, the queen of wands, and then you have the king of wands here. All right, so there's definitely some forward movement here. Source is stepping in, moving you forward, going after what you want very passionately. Looks like you are rocking that masculine and feminine energy, bringing in balance. Okay, I love it, love it, love it. There's possibly some travel, uh, possibly decisions to make some moves. And uh, that's coming. What did I just tell you? All right. So, yeah, there's possibly some travel or, you know, you're um, expecting to make some big changes here in your life. I like it. Moving forward. So it's just working with you, sweetheart. All right. I like to see this balance here as well. What did I say? All right. Two of Pentacles trying to bring it in. Bring balance to your life. All right. So there's a decision that you are juggling at this time. Looks like you're focusing on healing, closing out old cycles, and uh, learning new lessons. You may be studying something, going to school for something. I don't know. Could be somebody that you're watching. I don't know. Could be somebody watching you. Let's see. is going on here you have the queen of swords in reverse sweetheart okay so you are uh not playing with anybody at this time what's going on here all right very stern not taking no no ish somebody say my might, might say you've been a bit bitchy i don't know but it looks like you're actually moving in a new direction okay there are some things that are still weighing on your heart, and it looks like you close that heart off to, you know. Mm, looks like you're not trying to receive no love at this time. You're very stern and, and strict with people. This is crazy with this king and queen of wands and this queen of swords in reverse. You're a bitch on wheels. My God. It's okay. All right. Don't let what you went through destroy your future or... You know, um, Leo, I know you got a beautiful soul, sweetheart, but whatever you went through, don't let this harden your heart, okay? Keep the faith. Know that there is something else coming for you, okay? So, yeah, just be prepared to move. Try to figure out what it is that you want in your life and uh, go for it, okay? Focus on healing and bringing balance into your life, all right? And do that shadow work as well, all right? Someone here may feel... Um, you know, a bit sad or whatever. Something didn't work out. I did see the Five of Pentacles here. So, someone here may be feeling a bit alone. Um, kind of upset that something didn't work out. But I do see that there is balance coming in here. You're focusing on yourself, okay? Um, the Queen of Swords in reverse, though, energy. We got to kind of get rid of that. There's nothing wrong with making head over heart decisions, but, you know, she's not the nicest person when she's in reverse, all right? So, yeah, just be mindful of that. All right, so you have the magician that is clarifying the world, all right? So, yeah, there's the magician and the eight of cups. So, there's definitely some forward moving, movement here. You are manifesting new beginnings, um stability in your life i don't know why but i just got tranquility okay so you're possibly focused on peace and balance in your life as well okay i do see that there is possibly some offers coming towards you and you possibly weighing your options here okay um really taking your time to evaluate a situation here give me more on the queen of wands two of pentacles trying to make a decision 
juggling, trying to, waiting for all the information. You don't have all the information that you need. Something's hidden here. Hmm. Someone here is trying to make a hit over heart decision. But there's some type of, there's something hidden here. You're waiting for the other shoe to drop. What is it that I don't know? Give me one king of wands. Page of swords. There's something that you're not sure of, so you're watching. Or this could be someone watching you. Wow, what is this? With the world, someone wants forward movement, so they're watching, stalking, lurking, looking. Is this you? Somebody's being indecisive about moving forward. Holding back. Let's see. I don't know if this is you. Give me more than two of pentacles. You could be dealing with somebody wants a new beginning here. Okay, so there may have been or may be an offer coming up on the table for you through someone. This could be your uh, divine counterpart, this king of wands here. Although you're showing up with both feminine and masculine energy, this could be your counterpart, a soulmate that's coming towards you, okay? Um, someone here may be juggling the option, you know, do I take this offer or whatever, you know, somebody is coming in with something stable, but someone here may also be concerned that there's a third party situation. So they might be a bit worried, hesitant about, you know, stepping off into this situation. All right. Because they feel that there may be somebody else. Someone here may be juggling. Okay. So, oh my goodness. Someone is walking away from a lot of situations that, you know, didn't flourish, didn't go anywhere. There are a bunch of empty cups, so they're manifesting a new beginning. So now this person has gone through a lot of BS in the past. They're hesitant to move forward towards this person. They feel like this is their mate, the king of wands or the king of wands. So they're just sitting here looking at the situation, trying to balance it out. Not sure if they want to take this cup. Because they're over the situations that have happened in the past. All these people, these people came in with the same things and it's nothing different. So someone is trying to weigh their option here. It looks like your counterpart is possibly waiting for you to decide if you're going to take my cup or you're going to take my offer. Until then, they're watching. I'm not sure. This could be you. This could be you in the masculine and feminine energy deciding if you want to make an offer towards someone else watching this person. Um, realizing that there are some cups in the past that did not offer you anything. They were pretty much Kool-Aid, okay? You want wine and this is Kool-Aid, all right? So, yeah, you're walking away from some things that no longer serve you, possibly watching your person, all right? Wanting to communicate, deciding if you want to, you know, juggling the option. Do I want to try this again? Do I want a new beginning again? Do I make this offer to this person? I don't know. Why is the Queen of Swords in reverse? Oh, wait, I didn't see this. Okay. You got a son here. Somebody's trying to juggle this option. This person is very happy with you, or you are happy with this person. However, Someone is trying to decide, is this the best thing for me? Because someone feels that they might be juggled. Yeah, somebody that gets a lot of attention. Look at this. Yeah, somebody has a lot of love for you. They want to offer this cup of love. However, they feel that this person has multiple lovers. They get a lot of attention from other people. Okay, and someone here is in their head about this situation. Not sure if they should go for it or not juggling the option, taking a break from it, just looking at it like, damn, you know, I don't know. I really don't want to be bothered with a situation that's going to have me stuck. All right. So somebody is holding back and not in the best of moods about it either. Let's see. Trying to be rational, but looks like somebody's heart is involved here. Temperance, trying to bring, be patient. All right. Be patient, bring balance into the situation, trying to make it make sense. Because someone here is kind of, I don't know, I won't say off balance, but it looks like this Queen of Swords in reverse is not taking no joke. All right, if you're coming in playing games, I'm about to let you have it, pretty much. And what it is is that she knows that she's dealing with a King of Wands. Yeah, you're coming in with the King, but the Wand is 
a super big priority to this king. So they like to share the wand and this is the person. This queen of swords is really kind of like, you know what? I don't know if this is good for me to invest in. Should I even give to this situation or should I move away? So I think someone here is really having a struggle whether to move forward or move on. Yeah, look at this. What did I just say? What did I just this? What did I say? I cannot make this up, even if I wanted to, sweetheart. This person is trying to decide, do I stay? Do I go? Do I put an end to this? Do I take this offer? What, what do I do here? So until then, you're just stuck. Do I give to this situation? So until a decision is made here, someone is kind of just stuck, kind of juggling the pinnacles. Do I? Don't I? Do I? Don't I? This is a trip here. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let me get some of these. I haven't used these in a minute. Give me messages about the situation, please, for Leo. Give me two. Okay, so it says release, radical acceptance, surrender, and surrender can help you let go. All right, so, um, yeah, you got to look at things for what they are, you know, and don't fantasize about it. Just take it how it is, you know. If this person's very promiscuous, sweetheart, you might want to look at that, you know, if that's something that you want to deal with. I don't know, but just be real about it, okay? Um, yeah, don't uh, fantasize about the situation. Um, try to put more into it than what it is. You know, it is what it is. So accept that and, and uh, make your decision. All right, it says stability. This relationship can stand the test of time. If you two were to get on the one accord, it could. You guys are... Um, divine counterparts you match each other king of wands to the king uh queen of wands i'm just saying so it says soulmate your soulmate loves and accepts you and respects you unconditionally yeah i put too many ands in there but yeah okay so this is definitely a soulmate like i said this person is coming up as your divine counterpart so uh you got to figure out what y'all gonna do about this situation what else gonna do i don't know All right, well, I'm going to put it like this. Um, you really need to look at this situation, study the situation, figure out what happened in the situation that didn't work out with you guys, and uh, try to fix it, okay? So, yeah. All right, so let's see. That's for people. Uh, it was supposed to be just a general, but apparently somebody wants somebody from their past. So, yeah, or somebody, this could be somebody that you're currently dealing with. I don't know. Take it out of okay? All right, so what about new love for Leo? Didn't expect that to take that twist, but okay. All right, what about new love for Leo? For the people that aren't dealing with anybody, for the singles. What's going on for the single Leo's? Knight of Pentacles. You got somebody coming in really slow. Taking their time. Damn. King of Wands. <laughs> That's funny. All right. Five of Pentacles. Queen of Wands in reverse. Four of Cups. All right, look, you have someone that um, that's coming towards you very slowly. They do want to communicate with you. This person is possibly getting ready to divulge some feelings for you. Um, 
they're going to try to get you to look at them from a different perspective. I don't know. You know what? Oh, my God. Okay. Two scenarios. Some of you have someone that's coming in towards you very slow. This could also be um, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Um, this could also be Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. It could be any element because we have the cups here as well, okay? Um, however, I see this person approaching you very slowly. There may be some things from their past, um, past baggage that they have to, you know, release or whatever. But this person sees you and they're like, hmm, you know what, Leo? I, I kind of like Leo. Let me see if I, you know, can kind of mosey on over here and see what's going on with Leo. However, there is a situation possibly from a past situation where someone is feeling, um, like the Five of Pentacles, left out in the cold, abandoned. Um, I don't know. Yeah. Um, I don't know if this is you or this other person. However, someone here has gone through something in their past that um, that's still kind of sitting with them. This person, I hate to say it, but... This person may be a bit jealous, okay? Yeah, this person may be a bit jealous, envious of other people because they've gone through some other things, okay? Some things with uh, some other people. Also, I do see that there is an offer being made here, but it might not be exactly what you want. Somebody's trying to decide whether to come towards you or not. Like I said, they have gone through some stuff in the past, and I do believe that they are leaving the things behind and moving towards you. You look happily single, abundant, doing your thing, but you do look a little bit closed off, okay? I do believe that this may be someone that you are aware of already, someone that is in your surroundings, your circle. All right, King of Wands wants forward movement, wants to take this leap of faith in a new direction, however... Someone here, like I said, has been hurt from the past. They've gone through some things from the past, okay? And although they're acting like things are fine, this person is still hurt and still has some um, deep trauma that they are, um, that they're dealing with, okay? But what this person feels to realize is that they are manifesting the new beginning, they're asking for new people to come in their life, but they're closed off. Let's see. The outside appearance. Yeah. Five of Cups. Five of Pentacles is clarified by the Five of Cups. This person hasn't gotten over the past. They're keeping things to themselves, okay? Like I said, this person is suffering in silence. Everything is fine, but it's really not, okay? Keeping it to themselves, not really revealing how hurt they are closed off, not given to a situation. And when it comes to getting into a relationship with this person, this person might be a little bit jealous. Yeah. Ooh, judgment. This person doesn't make the... Ooh, look at this. Toxic shit. Yeah, this person is possibly uh, spending time by themselves uh, for a while. Um, refusing to make a, a decision about this situation as well because this person is afraid that they are going to get played, that they're dealing with something toxic. They have some, man, they have some self-sabotaging, um, a self-sabotaging mindset here. And this person has possibly been by themselves for a while. All right, but here comes this Knight of Pentacles wanting to come in and make this offer, but this person is afraid that there's going to be drama, conflict, other people, lies. Oh my goodness, what the hell? Give me the Four of Cups. So this could be you, this could be the Cross Watcher. Yeah, this Eight of Wands in reverse clarifies the Four of Cups. This person doesn't look like they want to take this offer. They feel that the, that... This offer is coming in. It's the same thing that they've gotten before, okay? Drama. So this person is is pretty much closed off, trying to protect themselves. They're tired. They're hurt. 
all right? And the things that they've gone through has pretty much turned them from the queen of wands upright. Someone that's very confident, stable, you know, knows their ish, knows what they want to someone that's possibly very indecisive, um, finds herself in relationships or situationships that never go anywhere. This person possibly has been lied to, cheated on and things like that. So this person does not trust. So they get angry quick and they are very jealous. Okay. There's some toxic situations here that are keeping this per person from moving forward and accepting other, um, other offers that are coming through. This person may be watching you. Okay. They may figure that, you know, yeah, I could be happy, you know, with this person or, you know, Maybe the cross watcher. This is Leo looking at you. You know, like I could be happy with this person, but they got too much stuff going on here that they haven't released. I don't know. Take it how it resonates, but somebody's gone through a lot of stuff and they're really guarded and kind of closed off here. There's offers coming in, but this person is afraid that they're going to receive the same thing that they've already experienced in the past, okay? So yeah, there's that. Sorry, Leo, this is what's coming out in the cards, but I don't know. So what's going on with money? <laughs> what's happening with money for Leo? Yeah, the two of cups, there's a possibility that you may be partnering with someone in a business. You have the fool and the ace of cups. The source is telling you to take a leap of faith in a new direction. There may be something coming down for you or you're working with friends, family, or whatever that is going to be very prosperous and lead you to the ten of, I'm sorry, the king of pentacles. Have you financially stable, set, looking good, affording anything that you want, okay? All right, so at this point in time, you may feel stuck, not knowing what to do, not seeing your way. Source is telling you, step out on faith, okay, because what's coming for you is that Ace of Cups and offer is coming in for you, okay, people that want to work and collaborate with you. So yeah, I'm going to leave this right here because this reading was a whole trip and a half this morning. And um, for those of you that kept your subscription while I was moving, thank you so much. I appreciate the loyalty and uh, yeah. If you like how I get on with my readings, please let me know uh, by hitting the like button or hitting the comments because there are some readings or some signs that I am going to be eliminating so that I can get quality instead of quantity, okay? So, yeah. Um, thank you for rocking with your girls. Take care. Bye.